this is a very subtle story. Did you, that worry you or attract you? You know, this is not the Terminator. You know, is this? Uh, well, is, 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 it, is this a? Yeah. It isn't. Well, yeah, what are you saying, Kenny? <laughs> um, it absolutely <laughs> attracted. I mean, you know, one of the great things that Nick I think did in the screenplay was it was to have the, the eminent good sense to not over dramatize. Yes. And the book is a is the most wonderful slow build of really deep emotion so that by the end the last 40 pages is is quite breathless you you know you can, you're doing, wanting to know which way she's going to choose to go and it's i i had absolute faith that with the right actors the um, the experience on the screen would be profoundly emotional actually and that we had to trust that and not try and ramp it up with with sort of um, fake melodramatic events injected in or to try and dial stuff up in any way um, it just felt like it, it was a film which needed to be directly emotional not cool not indie not hip in any way or ironic or detached you had to get go for it you had to yes, really yes. and and risk falling <laughs> flat on your face and never sentimental that was the key was to try and hit that exact bit of the target is that the lure and the challenge of a, of a part like this to get it just right yeah, it was, I have to say. I, I think, to be honest, as actors, you know, this a film like this is so unusual for all the reasons that you've both mentioned, but by mm -hmm. the same token, for an actor going into something like this, you're so used to having the emotional scene yeah. and the happy scene and yeah. the reconciliation and the, you know, uh, all that stuff. And to to have someone like John who just... No, he noticed everything, you know, yeah. you, you couldn't, you weren't <laughs> led away with anything, you know, and it, it was great because there, there were times where you would kind of naturally probably want to go even more emotional, especially because of my connection to yes. it too, yes. I think. Yeah. There were so many times where I could have cried <laughs> even more than I did in this because <laughs> it meant so much, you know. And to have him there kind of go, no, 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 just dial it back a little bit. Yeah. It's it, yeah. Of course it's tougher to... It's more of a challenge to, to do nothing, you know, yeah. or to underplay something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, as you say, it probably goes against your instincts a little bit. Well, I mean, you know, my, my instinct, I mean, I've had to do auditions before where people are like, be funnier <laughs> or make it bigger or smile a bit more or, God. you know, I know, <laughs> awful. But uh, smile, you want me to smile? <laughs> Ugh. But I've, I've always found my instinct is more to, you know, be quite minimal but 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 still you're so used to people expecting yes, yes. more you know and and to work on a film like this where as you say it's very subtle and it's dare I say not simple it's it's deeply deeply emotional but there are no huge kind of melodramatic yeah, moments yeah. in it